All right, so uh, I'm trying something new. I found an old uh, GoPro at the Hero 2, I think. Maybe just the Hero, I'm not sure. Um, I found it the other day just laying under my bed. <clears throat> Still, like, I have the box and everything that it came in. Um, I bought it thinking I was going to be able to motovlog with it, you know, years ago. And, you know, uh, anybody that had the Hero or the Hero 2, I think, I think it was the Hero, I'm not sure. But they know that you can't record audio with an external microphone with it. So basically, to motor vlog, I would have to record the video and the audio separate somehow and splice them together. So basically, that turned into a little toss camera. You know, I had the, the chest harness and helmet harness and all that shit for it. So basically, if I do anything outside, I can throw it on and uh, run around with it. Well, I found a um, handlebar mount for some camera. I can't remember what it was. And I rigged it up so I can use my GoPro with it. And I've got it fastened to the, uh, the rear passenger grip shit that's on the back. And uh, hopefully it's recording. I'm not even sure. It's been so long since I played with it. I don't even know if it's recording right now. But uh, I was just—I thought I'd give it a try. You know, try it out, see what what it looks like, and you know, it may add a different view to my uh, videos that it, you know that I like and that everyone likes. But uh, we'll see. Today it's like. 75 I think so it's been perfect you know today I, I went and rode this morning uh, to go to the gym and all but I didn't get to, to record because my battery was d uh, pretty much dead um, so I, I was letting it charge while I went to the gym and just forgot to put it back on until uh, until I left just now have much of a topic um, just thought I would throw it on try out the, the new camera set and uh, see what's going on uh, you know I slammed on brakes because that cop that's a fucking Walton County Sheriff and we're in Barrow County so I, I was going 80 anyway so So, um, someone asked me the other day why I always speed uh, while I'm riding, and they were, very, they were talking about how specific, I, uh, can't talk today guys, how specific I am about my speed, um, that I'm usually going t exactly 10 over um, when I'm riding around. Well, the problem is, I, first of all, who... Uh, how you saw my speedometer and can tell my speed is pretty awesome. You got must have a very good, uh, good sight because I can't from my videos. I can't ever tell the speed. But then again, I'm also not looking at it that much, so whatever. But anyways, um, my bike run, my speedometer runs five miles an hour over my actual speed. So like right now I'm running 45 by my speedometer I'm actually going 40 so whenever anyone goes oh you're running 10 over I'm actually running 5 over I try not to ever go 5 miles an hour over the speed limit you know it happens um, because first of all it's just fun but you know speeding is just a natural part of riding a motorcycle or driving a car you know it's gonna happen so but whenever you see me going 10 over again I'm going 5 um, I know how to fix it and everything I'm just lazy you know I've clocked I've had Georgia State Patrol clock me and I've done a side-by-side -side test and all of it comes out exactly five miles an hour over so to me it's easy just to look down and go okay 50 I'm going 45 you know oh whoa, whoa.
so that's uh, that's the reason why I'm running that fast it's really it's really that I'm not running that fast are you f dude this guy is such an asshole he pulled out went slow as fuck and then ran the light But yeah, that's why I run, uh, I run 10 over, it's actually I'm running 5, so, I, uh, I keep losing my train of thought, guys, sorry. Um, but yeah, the, most police officers will tell you that they'll, they'll, you know, like city police, um, and county will give you, uh, 10 miles an hour, um, Georgia State Patrol usually gives like five so I figure if I just run five over I'm pretty much not going to get a ticket unless I get a real fucking asshole but the uh, judge will usually throw it out yeah it's like um, like I was saying before it's like 75 today yesterday it was close to 70 so it's it's starting to warm up and I'm, I'm really glad because I haven't been able to ride but like sporadic like one day for half a day because you know if you ride in the morning it's freezing and you know it's been uh, it's been pretty nice um, I think it's actually going to drop back down tomorrow to like 40 something degrees and it's supposed to be raining and shit so I don't I don't know this weather is so sporadic right now um, I just don't know what's going on you know I, I made a video um, that didn't turn out a couple days ago um, sorry. Um, I made a video actually it was when I first tested out the uh, the rear camera um, I, I don't know what it was uh, Saturday I think yeah yeah today's Tuesday yeah it was Saturday when I, I tested it out it was like 65 I think um, yeah, somewhere around in there, but the, uh, the video didn't turn out, but, um, it, I don't know why, but for some reason, the audio on this was cutting in and out, so hopefully it's working now, um, I reset it, reformat the, uh, the, what do you call it, the SD card, a micro SD, um, so hopefully everything is, is working properly, but there were, I had actually some pretty good footage, um, when I rode then, um, because I had someone right up here pull out in front of me, um, I was going back the opposite direction, and someone pulled out of here, out of this little side road here. When I was, no, I was going the opposite direction. I was about here when they pulled out, and they ran 40 miles an hour. This is 55 through here. They ran 40 miles an hour once they pulled out in front of me, all the way to that red light. So when we got the red light, I pulled up beside them and just kind of looked at them for a second. And the bitch shoots me a bird, and so I yelled at her and you know said some things that are not for children's ears, and. Um, and I went on around her. Well, she started trying to ride my ass and shit. And so there was a big ass truck in front of us. So I went around that one in the turn lane to get some space between us. Um, yeah, so yeah, but, but I, like I said, I didn't get any of it. Well, I got the footage, but it didn't turn out. It was so like the. Then it sounded almost like the, the maybe I didn't have the microphone plugged in all the way like it was buzzing in and out or something I'm not sure I'm hoping that my fucking camera isn't messing up I've had a couple problems out, out of it recently but we'll see hopefully uh, nothing else happens because I, I hate fucking erratic drivers and aggressive drivers while I'm riding a motorcycle even though I am one <laughs> um, oh, so 
you know, I don't have much to talk about. I didn't really think of a topic again. Um, I was just kind of, this is mainly a test, but, you know, what the hell, I haven't posted a video in a while, so might as well. Um, so, some of you may know, I don't know if all of you do or not, but I play uh, guitar, bass, and uh, keyboard. Well, I just recently uh, purchased a drum set. Uh, it's just a little electronic drum set. I just wanted to try it out. You know, I didn't want to spend thousands of dollars on a uh, on something that I didn't know if I was even gonna like or really be able to play or anything. So, I uh, and I also needed something kind of small. So uh, I bought an electronic drum set, and I've been playing on it for uh, about a week now, and it's really fun. Um, I didn't think at first that I was really going to be able to handle it, but it's actually easier than what, I'm not saying drums are easy, it's definitely not. No, no instrument that I've personally learned how to play has been easy, but it's not been as hard as what I was thinking it would be. Um, and you know, with me, all of the things I, I've learned how to play, I've been, um, self-taught. I've never taken a lesson on keyboard or uh, ba bass or guitar or anything and uh, I'm not going to take lessons with this one either so that's why it usually it takes me a little, a little bit longer to uh, you know start learning how to play something but you know at least I can sit there and say yeah I didn't have any help with it you know it was all, all me Holy shit, it's hot, dude. It's, it's like, like I said before, it was like 75, and I'm, I threw the leather jacket on because I figured I'm going to be coming home at like 9.30 or 10, so it'll probably be pretty cold, but man, I'm sweating my ass off in here. This is why I don't wear a jacket in the summertime. You know, I've got jeans and a jacket and a t-shirt on right now, and I'm, I'm fucking dying. It's only 70, you know, when it gets up close to fucking 100 degrees... I can't be wearing all this shit. You know, I know it's safety and all, but fuck. I would, I would fucking be dehydrated and pass out by the time I get to where I'm going. So, um, one thing I'm going to start doing, I don't know why, but, um, the video I posted talking about wrestling Jeff Bedard, um, I had someone ask, could I post some, uh, videos of me training? So, I'm not, at my gym, they don't, I've already tried that once, um, they don't allow, uh, cameras in there, so I can't really film there. But what I can do is film everywhere else. Like when I go here and uh, just do some some free rolling um, and stuff after class, I can do that. I can film that. And uh, any of the stuff I do at my house, I can put on there. So I, if you guys want to see it, um, I can put, put the GoPro on my, uh, on my chest and fucking show you when I'm running up and down the streets and all and how I get prepared and all. But, you know, I don't know. Like I said, it, it was a little, it, it wasn't weird, but it was kind of odd that someone asked to see a bunch of training videos, you know what I'm saying? But I get it. It's cool. So if you guys want to see it, just let me know. Um, and I'll try to do as much as I can. Most of it will probably just be fucking, you know, heavy bag work and shit around the house like that and running and, so, and such. But anyways, guys, um, hopefully this video turned out. Um, thank you for the view and the support, guys. I appreciate it. Um, and as always, you know, if you have any requests, let me know. I'd be glad to, uh, to get them to you. Thanks, guys.